Welcome back. You watch your morning live. Now, Pretoria is currently playing host to a play called Moe Street Moves. The sketch takes us back to Hillbrow in 1992 when a black man's path crosses that of a small town white fellow and shows him the ropes of how to survive the fast paced city of gold. This production that is underway at the State Theatre in Pretoria and will run until the 25th of August was directed by Momo Motsinyane and features South African renowned actors Latsi Mafatse and Theo Landy, well a known actor. Lutzi joins me in studio and the producer Majamela McClone joins me here to talk about this uh, awesome production. Guys, thank you very much for joining me. Good morning. Good I think morning. we have to declare that there's a love interest between um, <laughs> Majamela and Lepo. It involves me. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about it a little bit later. There's a love thing here. Yeah. Let's talk about Moist Street Moves uh, quickly. I mean, we try to give us a little way in the, in the intro. Why is it something we have to view? Um, I mean, I, this is probably where it began. 2014, I met Matlat in Gramstown, and we had yeah. a conversation about it. But it was around um, uh, the racial tension that's happening in the country now. And, and we said, you know, we still tell us what do we find to tell the story. Mm. And Moe Street uh, is a play that speaks to that because it speaks of the, pre, uh, the post declack pre-Mandela era, mm. so between 90 and 92. Mm. And as a country, I think we were on tenterhooks because we just came from this nightmare, mm. but we didn't know what the hope was. So Moe Street gives us a human element of that. Um, it features two characters, Henry Stone, who arrives in Joe to find that things have changed. He gets Jobek, he meets Dix Ditebe, who's taken mm. over Jobek because Mandela is out of prison now, mm. right? And, and for the next 90 minutes, we get to go on a roller coaster of emotions of the two guys just giving us the two faces of a nation divided and, and speaking at a human level about, mm. about those relations. I, I like what uh, Majamela m mentions the roller coaster because. Uh, it's not like we haven't dealt into this subject matter before, mm -hmm. but we have to find new ways of telling the story so that new audiences and even the ones that have already been conscientized at theatre find something new in the subject matter, mm -hmm. right? I think it's about time that we become real about our issues and not run away from them mm. and do with them direct in the best way that we know how, not what we think of. And, and moisture it moves talks about that. It deals with us dealing with the issues that we, mm. we hear on the radio, we see on TV, and now we see the characters deal with it, you know? Mm. And, 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 and I, I, I think, uh, as, as a person with yeah, what happened in, in, in Pretoria, in, mm. with the elections and everything else, um, it's about time that we, we go reflect on, on, on what we've been looking at instead of what we are dealing with. What is sticks? Is sticks a representation of the past, of the future? Is sticks everything that is... Sticks is present. Yeah. It's present. Sticks is, is what we wish we, we, we could become. Mm. And, and, and we see that with, with how we, we, we deal with racial issues. Mm. We deal with financial issues, with the country, with status issues. Mm. And, and the play deals with that. But it also dwells on, 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 on what we understand. So we talk about soccer, we talk about rugby, we talk about all the other elements that make us combine the, the, the mm. nation. But it hits it hardcore yeah. in terms of emotion. Because when, when, when we are emotional, we go, ah, so one man does it, one, two, yeah. three, four, yeah? But, you, but also he's in yeah. the middle, you know? Yeah. He, he's a middle man in the play. Yeah. So he's in the middle. He's, he's a conduit. He's, he's, yeah. he's, he's, he's what liberals aspire to achieve, but he's what pan-Africanists uh -huh. hope for the future. Yeah. You know, look, yeah. y you've put together a quite a dynamic cast from the director to the producers to all of that kind of stuff. But f essentially, when you talk about emotion, let's talk about dialogue, because dialogue is that carries that through. How specific were you around the kind of dialogue that you use between these two characters that talk about the present and the past? It's real. I mean, I mean it's very real. I think Paul, Paul Slab gave us a beautiful, beautiful play with Moe because it's dialogue written. So it's not one of those plays. Yeah. But, but Momo's choices were beautiful because mm. Momo decided to go physical with it. So there's a physical yeah. element into it which makes it really authentic South African, you know, because our industry is based on physics. We mm. start in a 
community hall with nothing. But but in the play, the dialogue is very real. It speaks of. I mean, it's, I, I wish Penny Sparrow could come watch the play. <laughs> it will help her, you know. Because <laughs> it will help she her. Needs because to she needs watch to watch the play. Because and the many sense. other Penny Sparrows, uh, you know, all of them. You know, because because it speaks of now and and it, it deals with uncomfortable truth mm. about white privilege, about black entitlement. It speaks about the opportunity that's missed between the two. You know, it speaks of the land issue. It the, there's a huge metaphor with the back in the play that happens over 28 minutes. Mm -hmm. um, uh, that's that's beautiful that we enjoy because it it speaks about holding on to things and how as a country we are where we are because they, there's a group of us who are holding on. Because we are emotional hoarders. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gentlemen, we have fortunately run out of time. It sounds incredibly interesting. I'm going to encourage everybody to go and watch it. Directed by Momo Matsunyane. Uh, and, of course, in studio with us is producer Majamela Mutlong and actor Mutlatsi Mafatse talking to us about uh, a latest production called Moist Street Moves. It's a comic sketch that is currently underway at the State Theatre in Pretoria and will run until the 25th of this month. Come on. Everybody, let's go and support this production. Take your family, take your friends, take those enemies. Let's go and watch it together and build a nation.